Hey YouTube, how are y'all doing today? It's Vlogmas Day 13 and it's already lunchtime. I didn't even have a chance to get on here and say good morning like I normally like to. I have hit the ground running today. How was y'all's weekend? Did y'all have a good time? Did you get a chance to look at the vlogs from this weekend? I hope you enjoyed them. I am going to be posting this one probably later today and I'd love to hear how your weekend went. So just leave me a comment in the comments below. Let me know how it went. Hey YouTube, how's it going? It's the end of the day. Ooh, I'm looking worse for wear. And I just wanted to come and say hello. It's day 13 of Vlogmas. I tried to say good morning this morning and got interrupted. So I did a quick message at lunchtime. And now I'm actually at home. I've had a very long, productive day. And so I'm very happy to be in the house. So tell me, you guys, how was your day today? I hope you're enjoying these little videos. I think during the week they're going to be a lot shorter because I work full time. And so there's really not a lot to talk about. I'm sure you don't want to watch me work or my commute every day. So we'll just have a little maybe just chats during the week. And then on the weekends, we'll actually have fun activities that we do together. You know, today didn't really seem like a Monday to me. I know it is Monday, but it didn't feel like it. And there was not a lot of traffic on the road today. I wonder if anybody else experienced that. That was actually really nice because I was running a little bit late. Had a hard time getting up today. So I was just like, please, Lord, let there not be a lot of traffic. And there was not. I got to work on time. It was such a blessing. So I was happy about that. But uh, the day went by pretty quickly. Um... Nothing really eventful happened, which is, you know, sometimes a good thing. But um, I'm thinking this week should be kind of quiet. It's the week before Christmas. And so I think this is a lot of people either took off this week or this is their last week in the office before they're going to be out. And so next week's traffic should be on point. Are any of you guys taking off for the holidays or are you working and just taking off maybe Christmas and New Year's Eve? I will be working and um, I'll be taking off of course you know Christmas Eve and Christmas those are company holidays for us but I'll be working so if you're working don't feel bad because I'll be right there with you so let me know what your plans are in the comments below let me know what your plans are for the holiday season are you going to travel are you going to stay home is your family near you what are you going to be doing and also how close are you to being done with your Christmas shopping because I really am close to not having started. I want to say I might have bought one gift or two gifts, but I think I'm going to do online shopping this year and not get out there in those stores. So, you know, we'll see. Let me know how things are going for you guys. And we'll be seeing each other tomorrow in tomorrow's Vlogmas. So have a good night. Make sure you rate, comment, and subscribe and come back. And in the comments below, if there's anything else you want me to talk about, let me know and I'll be happy to talk about that. So have a good evening, guys. I'll see you tomorrow. Psych! You thought it was the end of the vlog, didn't ya? Didn't ya? Well, I did too. And I decided, you know what? I'm going to take them on a journey to watch me get ready for work tomorrow. What do I do to prepare? So let's take a look. First things first is I need to make myself some green tea. I need some stamina to get this food together and I'm tired. So I like to have a green tea at the end of the day after dinner and then I move on to my food prep. I was about to make some green tea and I almost forgot to put the mug under there. I was just about to push the brew button and I looked at it and said, oh, my cup's not there. That would have been a mess. I'm too tired y'all so <clears throat> I gotta get ready for work tomorrow so what I do is I prepare my breakfast part of it the night before and uh, that way in the morning when I'm running late as always uh, that's one less thing I have to do and tomorrow we're gonna have our company Christmas party so we're gonna go out to eat so I don't actually have to prepare a lunch so that's good as well so let's just see, what am I gonna make for my breakfast tomorrow? All right, so I mentioned in another vlog that I have, that I eat um, chicken and an apple every morning for breakfast. So this is my little trusty, oops, trusty scale. I'm gonna turn it on like so. I'm gonna put that in the ounces mode. Here's my bag of chicken. I buy frozen chicken. It's just faster. And this is the oven roasted, oops, oven roasted diced, good grief, 
I've been roasted diced chicken breasts and it tastes really good. And all you have to do is put it in the microwave for two minutes and you're good. So I've got my bag open. I'm gonna shake some pieces onto my, okay, I can't do this with one hand, so yeah. Do the best I can. All right, come on, come on. Shake, 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 shake. shake. All right, shake your chicken. Come on. There we go. I'm getting to four ounces. We're almost there. Come on, chicken. All right, another way. Oh, the struggle is real, guys. The struggle is real. Just need probably one more piece. Yep. And that's too much, of course. Alrighty then. So this is why I do it the night before. Because of crap like that. So close. And yet so far. Yay! So... I've got my four ounces of chicken here, and what I do is I'm going to put it in a Ziploc bag and put it back in the freezer for tomorrow. That way, all I have to do in the morning is heat it up in the microwave and move along with life. So here's my little baggie, and I'm going to throw that in the freezer along with the rest of the chicken that I did not use, and it's going to save me so much time in the morning. You would not believe. And also, the night before, I get my apple, and I cut it up. I have my trusty apple core here. And what I do is I, oh my God, this is so hard. Oh, there we go. I um, use the apple core and then I'm putting all the pieces back together again because I'm not gonna actually eat this until tomorrow and I don't want it to get all brown, you know, oxidized. So I squeeze it together like so and then I, Pull it off of the off of this apple core, and look at that. That has never happened before. Never. Usually, usually, <clears throat> the core comes too, and then what I do is I put it in this piece of aluminum foil that I have, and then when I put it in the aluminum foil, hold on, I need to get this core out. Please bear with me. Oh my gosh. Only because I'm filming. This has never happened before. All right. So I'm going to put the core in the center of the apple. Please stand by. All right. All right. So put the core in. <laughs> This is such a comedy of errors. I cannot even tell you because I put the core in upside down and it's a complete disaster. So, oh well, it is what it is. I'm gonna do my best to put this back together again like a puzzle and I'm still gonna wrap it up in the foil. I just can't believe this. This whole thing just self-destructed. Self Constructed. All right, well, I give up. I'm not going to spend here all night trying to get this apple back together. It just wasn't meant to be this time. You guys get the picture. I cut up my apple. It's supposed to remain intact. I put it in the foil, intact. And so tomorrow when I take it loose, it is intact and it is not um, brown. Now it does start to oxidize a little bit, even with this trick, but not near as much as what I'm gonna see tomorrow when I open this foil. Cause I'm still putting in the foil, but it won't have the, the core in there to keep it you know, nice and closed up. So we're gonna have a nice brown apple tomorrow, but so what, it's all good. So that's it. That's what I do the night before. Normally I would do my lunch as well. But as I mentioned, tomorrow is, I'm gonna wrap it up in foil. This is a disaster, y'all, like this is so embarrassing. I'm gonna have to do this again some other time where you can actually see when it functions well. It's never like a garbled mess, it's usually an actual apple. So anyway, 
I'm going to try this again some other day. <laughs> Huge fail. At any rate, uh, I won't have to make my lunch because as I mentioned tomorrow, we are having... So I'm not going to have to make my lunch because we're having our Christmas party tomorrow and we're going out to eat. So yay! So that's it, y'all. That's my um, nighttime food preparation routine. Next, I need to go and uh, get myself together for tomorrow. I've already picked up my clothes. i got to get my hair together. All that fun stuff. So that's it for real, for real this time. So you guys have a good night. And I'll see you guys tomorrow for Vlogmas number 14. So we're almost there, y'all. We're almost at 25. Can y'all believe it? Are y'all going to miss me? Because I am not going to be doing this every single day. I assure you once Vlogmas is over. So anyway, see you guys tomorrow. Have a good evening. And I'll see you for Vlogmas 14. Don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. Oh my God. I am seriously tripping. I thought that I had already made this tea. And so because I started to make it and then I walked off and did something else and so I thought oh yeah I need to drink my tea so I came back here and I took the mug out and it was empty and I said I never turned it on I'm, I'm really I need to go to bed like that it's ridiculous now I can't even turn on the thing like what is happening what is happening why why